Yo, what's going on guys? It's KevDog here, and in today's video, I'll be going over all seven mystery gift codes that still work in Scarlet and Violet. Technically, you can get some of these without redeeming an actual code, but regardless, they are still mystery gifts, and you should redeem them really quickly. The reasoning is because one of these codes expires on December 21st, and at the time of recording this, it's the 19th. You don't need Nintendo Switch Online or anything like that to be able to redeem these codes, so you guys are all going to be able to do this, and if this helped you out, then subscribe right now. Anyway, I hope you guys enjoy, and the first code that you should redeem right now is the one that's going to expire the quickest. The code you want to type in is New Moon is Coming, and this code is going to give you a Darkrai on your game. The Darkrai is not shiny or anything like that, but it's still a mythical Pokemon that they're giving out for free with redeeming a code, so you should definitely get this. If you're watching this after the 21st of December in 2023, though, sadly, you will not be able to get this anymore. The next mystery gift will give you an item and not a Pokemon, and it's a really good one, like a really good one. Thankfully, this code will last a bit longer because it's not going to expire until January 3rd of 2024 and you will get a Master Ball for redeeming this. All you gotta do is go into Mystery Gift and click on Receive via Internet at the top instead of Get via Code slash Password, and you'll get given a Master Ball. Next up is another free Pokemon, except it's not entirely free, because you need to own the DLC to redeem this. The Pokemon I'm talking about is a non-shiny Hisuian Zoroark. This is a gift for buying the Hidden Treasure DLC. Everyone will get their own unique code, so if you see a code online, the odds are it was already redeemed by someone else first. You'll have until Leap Day, which is February 29th of 2024 to redeem your Zoroark if you haven't already. Next, we have what a lot of people are saying is the best mystery gift on this list because it's for Shiny Lucario. You're gonna have until January 3rd to redeem this just like with that Master Ball from earlier and the code is Shiny Buddy. Honestly, I feel bad for all the people who are gonna see this video after January 3rd because sorry, but you just missed out on a Shiny Pokemon. The next code will give you one of two possible Herba Mystica which can help you find Shiny Pokemon. The code is Sweet or Spicy and just like with the previous code, you have to change some of the vowels around to numbers to make the code work. It's sweet or spicy, but the word or is actually a zero instead of an O, and spicy has a one instead of an I. It'll be completely random whether you get given one sweet or spicy Herba Mystica, so go check it out and let me know what you got. Next up, we got the code like a flute, which will give you a free Satitan, and no, it's not a shiny or anything like that. Redeeming this will give you a free Satitan to celebrate the Paldean Winds anime. Me personally, I've never seen a single episode of this anime. I don't know what it's about, but I'm guessing Satitan appears at some point. You're gonna have until August 31st of 2024 to redeem this to Titan, and I forgot to say, but for the Herba Mystica, you'll have until the end of September 2024. Next up, you can claim a free Rev of Room by redeeming the code Team Star. It's gonna have a fighting terror type, but other than that, I don't think there's anything too special about it, and you're gonna have until Halloween of 2024 to redeem this. The final code is gonna be See You in Paldea, which will give you a Gimme Ghoul in the chest form. This is the code that's lasting the longest from the time I upload this, because you'll have until November 30th of 2024 to redeem. The code is CU in Paldea, and of course the I in the word in is a one. Technically, I talked about eight mystery gifts in this video, but I'm only titling it seven because one of them does require you the DLC to actually redeem it. These are all free for you to claim except for the DLC code, and I really hope this helped you guys on your Pokemon Scarlet and Violet playthroughs. If you guys want to know about these codes right when they come out, I usually make a YouTube short on this channel for the new codes, so definitely check out my shorts. Anyway, thank you all so much for watching, and I'll see you guys soon. Peace out, everyone. You can't even see me, it's too dark. But peace out, everyone. Whoa.